The custom video player has many, many different features so you can fully customize your videos. In this video, I'll show you how you can quickly create a YouTube video and add that to your blog. So we're gonna head over to YouTube. We're gonna find a video on how to play a guitar. I've put the keywords in there and I'm just gonna pick this one here for this tutorial. Pausing the video. I'm just going to copy the link to the page where the video is located and back in the custom video player I'm just going to paste that into the video link. I have the option here to add a picture as well to the video so I'm just going to head over to photo bucket and here I'm just going to pick this picture here copy the direct link to the image and just paste it in there if you ever want to find out what the different fields are, you can always hover the mouse over the icons. Next, we choose the size of the video player. And I'm just going to choose a small size here. And we can choose a theme, which is going to be the skin of the player. So I'm going to choose simple white. Then we have our control options. We can choose to have the controls hide automatically when the video starts playing. We can place the controls below the video. We can hide the controls altogether, or we can lock the controls over the video, or we can crop the controls out. I'm gonna leave it on automatic for this video. We can choose the control size. So we've got slim, super slim, and standard. So I'm just gonna choose the slim option. And we can choose to auto start the video. We can choose to auto start it once, which means if somebody browses around our blog or website and comes back to the video, it's not gonna start playing every time. It'll just play the first time they arrive on the page. Or we can choose to have it start automatically every time, or choose not to have the video start automatically at all. I'm gonna choose that option for this one. We can choose to enable the click to pause where the viewer can click anywhere on the video screen to pause the video and then to resume playing again. So I'm gonna select that one. We can also choose for high definition videos and we can apply a transparency effect on the video player. I'm gonna leave that one unticked. And then we've got some really cool advanced features. We'll have a look at those in a different video. So I'm just gonna choose generate video code. So now it's gone, it's generated my own video code and it's given me a preview of the video player below. Now the great thing about the video code is there's no third party involved. So the video is actually loading from my own site where I've got my custom video player set up. And here we can see it's loading the preview image. And if you want a preview, you can click the play and the video starts playing. So all I need to do is copy the embed code, which is my own embed code. Go over to my blog and I'm gonna go into the HTML view and I'm just going to paste in my video code and choose publish. And now we can preview the post. And there we go. Our video player has been added to our blog. So that's how easy it is to create a custom video player. If you come to the video player and you're not fully sure about the player, you can go back to the custom video player and you can just edit your changes. You can adjust the size, you can change the theme color. Obviously you've got all these other options as well. And if you want to custom size, all those different features are in the advanced settings. You've got, you can give the video a title or description, customize the width and the height, you can give it a background color. You've got your logo settings, which we cover in a different video, where you can actually place affiliate banners inside the video, or you can put a logo in the video wherever you want that logo to, to appear. You've also got some share options, and when you enter the link of the page here, that's gonna activate the share options. 
you've got video site map generator built into the custom video player. So that's how easy it is to set up your videos with the custom video player.